once again and how is everyone who we got on tonight then today tonight whatever um hello clansman hello mark hello jason hello classics hello runny eggy eyes and hello if i've missed anyone out You can't see it because can you see it? I can't see it because it's so it's so light back there. Sun's out. Um, it's like a nuclear meltdown out there. Yeah, and I've got the blinds closed, the uh, curtains closed. And it's still bad. <laughs> <coughs> Bloody hell! Yeah, twenty. I think it's hit about twenty-five degrees today here. Yeah, the internet's doing well, well that's a good sign. If the internet's doing well then grow good. Because otherwise there's absolutely fuck all I can do about it. <laughs> so is everyone all good? So we've got six people on. Great. Well, I'll start half six today. Half six to half ten. <coughs> <coughs> so you got four hours of me to put up with. <laughs> Only joking, don't have to. You can switch off any time. <laughs> I look like Tim Roth. Bloody hell. Good. <laughs> Chewing a little cookie. <laughs> Bloody 5am. I thought my streams were long. Compared to Zyphos, they don't they're not that long at all. I can't I couldn't even stay up that sort of I I'll probably you know, I struggle when I watch Stefano's on anybody else's stream about from ten to twelve. I struggle to even stay awake then. But I try. But the thing is I watch I watch those streams on my phone, so when I'm in bed, so I watch them and But I really I even find it quite difficult to stay awake. So no chance of me um, lasting till 5 a.m. Yeah, I'll, I'll, as I said, I would, because it's just too late for me. No, I've got my beers. I'll have my beers tonight, so. The squash, the squash bottle won't even won't even get a look in. Might be till might have to might have to actually because I've got the fan on. It's bloody hot, so the squash bottle might come out. Actually, talking about the squash bottle coming out. to come out because I was feeling a bit thirsty there. Keep it by my bed so I know it's there. Paid Peter Rat Peter Pat Rat. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm surprised I can't find the arcade version of that. I thought being an old game I would I would have it, but I haven't got it. That's strange that. Of course it is, Claire, and sorry about that. Yeah, I got confused. 
I got confused. <laughs> of course I did. Uncle Paul. Yeah, it was Uncle Paul. I couldn't get it. it was, cause I saw someone doing it. I looked to see if anybody had a review on it on YouTube. Apparently it had. Someone has. And for some reason, I haven't got it. I can't get hold of it. What? <coughs> I heard something that uh, he's um, getting more um, family friendly, you know, he's appealing for families, not fat, you know, family people, you know, I mean, I mean for like people hosting a stream that sort of late, I mean, does it really matter if you swear or not? Because no kids should, no kids should be up that late. What new video? What new video is that? <coughs> yeah, exactly. I, I don't have any restrictions on my channel. No restrictions here. <laughs> Hello Mark Blaster, how are you doing mate? in the word gay yeah but that's not exactly swearing is it I had to have a go at him I mean, if he's coming on here tonight he, he tried to be a little bit sneaky there he, he requested one game Okay, I put that one on the list, and he requested another game. I didn't realise it because I've got quite a few on the list. I thought, no, I, I put one on. I'm like, hang on a minute, he's, he's requested two games here. Gee, yeah. Yeah, I, I I I sent him a message saying, hang on, you've already got one on the list. You can request one once I've done that game. Oh no 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 no. No the rules. Yeah, and I only applied that rule because, you know, make it easy for myself and it's fair for everyone else. That's why I, I... But you know what he's like, he tries to request so many games when he's on a live stream. Saying, well, let me, give me a chance, give someone else a chance. Grammy, what's that? Oh, God. Ain't Cash Cake is set 50 bad enough? <laughs> I don't know, Gremlin Graphics. I've never ten great games, yeah, but aren't they um games that already they already published anyway? I don't know, I've re quite reviewed quite a lot of Gremlin games. Yeah, that's the you know, I don't mind, but I like I don't mind re gaming requests, and, but not one after another from the same person. As I said, I like to. This is why I do this, so everyone can have a chance, everyone can have a turn. Yeah, but once the quiz is on, that's it. I, I you know, for me. It's the time I can relax, have a drink, and you know, it's, it gets everyone else involved. You know, that's why I do. I mean, thanks, thank Landsman for that, uh, bringing up the quiz games. I mean, I think it's been quite good. I, I quite enjoy it. Are you too good at the orange squash pop? <laughs> you can't even see it. It's, it's there somewhere. 
it's, it's, it's on the windowsill but because it's, it's the sun shining on the window it's like a nuclear meltdown and the blinds are shut the blinds are shut there and the curtains are shut <coughs> sun's so hot Alfie the same Monty, yes, that was a good game. Football all year, yes, that was another good game. Um, I have reviewed those. <laughs> what am I drinking today? I've got um, a nice can. Ah, no, 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 I'm not drinking any cups of tea. Ah, I'll be on the beers. I'll be on the beers later. Mysterio of the windowsill squash <laughs> Very good game. <coughs> Speaking about that. Hang on. I wonder why you can't see it. There it is. Oh, you still can't see it. Can you just about see it? You can't. Oh, no. It's hiding behind the wall. Go with that. You won't be able to see it because it's ideal it's on the other side of the window ledge. Ah, I need a drink because it's so hot. I've got a fan going so I have to, I do have the fan on because it's just too hot in here. Oh, it's only, I think it's going to get hotter during July or August and I'll have to have the I'll have to open the window, but I don't know. We'll see. How the, I don't know if I'm going to be in so much. I don't know because I might be because now the hot weather's coming. I might end up going out during some Saturdays. So we'll we'll see. We'll just play it by air for now. <coughs> Hello, Andreas. How you doing? I'm doing good, thank you. Yep, oh, it's day of the year. It is bloody hot down here. It's about 25, 26 degrees. <laughs> In the bar. Oh, I wish I was. Well, I was. At, wish I, well, I'm going to be probably be at the pub tomorrow, so, so that'd be all right. <laughs> God, 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 go down the pub. I'm going to see my mates for a while. Right, <coughs> who wants to request the first game? What we'll do, we'll do the gaming request part to about up our state, then we'll go to the quizzes, yeah, if you're all up for that. If you're up for another quiz night, maybe about our past eight, then I can have a drink and relax. Rockstar ate my hamster on the Amiga. Okay, why not indeed? I did I did say to you we was gonna play that, didn't I? Yeah alright, we'll play that. Alright, let's get the emulator. <laughs> oh god. <coughs> right. Configuration. What the bloody hell is it? Oh, here it is. Over 
Right. Actually, I can re I can relax playing this because I can get you all playing this. <laughs> nice one, nice one, classics. Mouse game in it. Yes. Is it a mouse game or a joystick game? Can't remember. Right, okay. I'll lead me to the screening room. Right. Oh it is mouse, good. Right, so let's all play this, shall we? So how many <coughs> How many rock stars do you want? The first one to come up with the answer, that's what we go with. Two, okay classics. And who do we want to select? Um, Wild Chief. Oh, this is Jason Donner Kebab, which is Jason Donovan. Um, this is... Oh, it's kind of an oak. This is George. That's oh, George. Uh, boy George, isn't it? That's Michael Jackson. Ah, oh, it's a brilliant game. Phil Collins, right, so that's Tina Tina Turnoff. Who's that? Clive Das Selton John. That's Iggy Crust, the Ziggy Ziggy Stardust. So we got one for Phil Collins and one for Lemmy. Okay. So let's see. Right, it's Phil Collins. So we we'll select him. And the other one's Lemmy. Lummy. Here we go. Right. <coughs> so we've got two Groovy to know this name band. Right, let's name our band. No. So what do you want to call it? I'm not, what I'm going to do, I'm not going to name, when we release albums and show, I'm not going to name all the tunes because it's just take too long. <laughs> Genocide, okay. Girls allowed. Oh my god. <laughs> Problem is we've got two men and we're gonna call each girls allowed. Girls not allowed more like. <laughs> right, so what do we want to boo? We're gonna buy some new stuff, second hand or dodgy gear. Classics is second hand. Right, so <coughs> should we do a practice gig? Publicity publicity gifts? Can save and load, or no, we don't want to quit. Barbecue juice. <laughs> Practice. Right. <laughs> How many days do you want to practice? Jack Hackett is a troll. No, I don't think he is. He seems like a nice person to me.
I mean, he's requested games before, he, he seems alright. Right, three days. <laughs> what you get? <laughs> it's wagey time, so I've still got quite a few, I bet uh, he must be a member of the Labour Party. <laughs> right, what do you want to do now? Nah, nah, he's, he's actually alright, he seems fine to me. No, no, he, he's all right. He seems fine. Right, let's do a gig. Right, pubs, clubs, universities, concert halls, or stadiums. Clubs. How many? How much shall we charge? Two, five, ten, fifteen, or twenty? And hello, DVD and film bloke. <laughs> right, five quid. Yeah, you bankrupt game last time, didn't you, DVD? <laughs> Right, Andre, this is five, all right? Oh, so many nights, are you saying five or five pounds? All right, five nights. Let's go. Oh, done well. 525. five. Yep, doing well. Another two five. Only 300 this time. Isn't it? Another two five. Well, that started off well. Stream has stopped. Did he? Well, is the stream okay? Can someone give me some feedback, please? Well, classic, classic scene. All right, uh, gifts. All right, what should we buy? I don't know. The, it keeps changing colour. It's going down the red, then it goes up to yellow, and goes to green, so I wouldn't be surprised. Keeps them happy, I guess, Andreas. I keep, it, I think it keeps the band happy if you buy them gifts. Keeps their morale up, I guess. Drinks. 200 quid. <laughs> Drugs. Right, what do you want to do now? Geek. <laughs> right, what do you want to do?
universities. Well, how uh, much on the charge? <laughs> How many nights? <laughs> yeah, I can just see that. Three nights. Oh, we've run out of money. Oh, we went bankrupt. Oh dear. Right, okay, we played that. So we want to request the next game. Oh, we'll be going on for a while this game actually. <laughs> How do we go bankrupt? Bet it was Phil Collins who probably cost too much. No, you're not responsible this time, DVD. There's no dio. Oh dear. Demolition Racer, what's that on? Is that on the Amiga? I can't I can't review PC games at the moment because I ain't got that set up with the emulation. Not with the emulation with the OBS. And DOS is too much I can't be be asked to deal with DOS games because they're too much fiddling about with DOS commands and I can't I can't be asked. <laughs> Lemmings. One game I won't do on a live stream, and that's play Stroker. <laughs> well, we'll have a few goes of Lemmings. Just a few, because this game will go on forever and ever otherwise.
I should have done a more difficult level actually. Hang on a minute. Let's put it on tricky. Oh, does it? Oops. I didn't see the first part. Was it 100% I needed? Actually, you can't be because you'll have to blow one up. Really? I don't know. I do. I like those bloody MSX games I've been playing, like Nemesis and bloody Gradius and stuff. Bloody hard. Oh, you should play the MSX version. It's a right bastard to play. I needed 50, I rescued 98, so that's alright. Right. Number of lemmings for 100% needs to be saved. Right, okay. And how the hell am I supposed to do that then? Oh right, got 40 diggers. So I'm going to have to put them all on dig, ain't I? Oh, I know what to do. you got to time this. Basically, you got to... Because you can run out of space on this one, so you've got to compact them all together. I remember this one. And you've got to do it in a bloody three minute time limit. Let's see if we can do this. Yet. Yeah. 
Right, okay, we'll leave that one. Who request who someone requested supercars, didn't they? Yeah, it is. Bloody unfair. Right, let's see if this works. I think I preferred the second one. I'm out, so I couldn't be bothered with my note. Hello, Tim, how are you doing? Oh, is it four to go in it? No, it's five to go. That's how it should be. Oh, damn, I fucking wasted that. Spent money on that bullshit. Get out of the way, you fucking... Get out of the way! Sorry, Tim, I haven't had a chance to listen to him, mate. Oh, one. Oh, so keep an eye on my damage. I haven't played this for ages. Yeah, I'm good, thanks. Alright, do I need to fix my car? Nah. Oh, no, that ain't crashed. You okay?
stand. Tell them why you silly little shit. Makes it harder for you. And I'm still in love. Damn, scared away. Damn, scared away. And my car is almost. Yeah. I think I originally had supercars on the Commodore 64. Then I bought both of them for the Amiga when I got my Amiga. I had to see all the Lotus games. Still got your Amiga. Oh, great! It's still, as it works, still working well. Congratulations, track two completed. Oh, I need to fix my car now. All right, Andrew. Another Andrew. Andrew B. No, Andrew Fisk. Andrew Fox. Fisk and Fox. Right, oh, I need to go to the garage and fix my car. Right, so... I'll fix my car then. Oh, right. How much money have I got? Oh, plenty of cash. Power steering. Turbo charger. Mm. Well, let's just buy the entire shop. Oh, I can't. Uh, I've got a major upgrade on my car now. No swearing? What are you talking about no swearing? <laughs> I don't I don't restrict my channels to no swearing. <laughs> Freedom of speech, mate. That was in third place. Damn. Shit. Get away. Fuckers. I ain't got no missiles. Get off it. Oh. Shit. 
Oh, Matt, how you doing? Shit, I'm looking at the bloody chat and I'm not concentrating on the road. That's why you should never text and drive. Congratulations, I'm doing well. <laughs> Bloody hell, you spent 100 quid on eBay. Did you buy on eBay? Did you buy another computer? Oh, I didn't go to the shops. Shit. Get away. There's the oil on it. Damn! Oh, football books. Come on! Done it again. Why? Bloody game, you why these bastards? Yeah, it's a weird, um, same with the Amstrad, the way the stereo works on that. So you get different noises coming out of each speaker. Alright, let's, well, let's go to the garage first. Looks like my car's on its last legs. I should have loads of money. Everything, fuck it, I can afford it. Oh, I can't afford the bodywork though, oh shit. I should really care, I should really, really be looking what I spend. Shit. Alright, track five, we're probably gonna blow up our car now. Missiles. And someone's got an upgraded car there.
face of mine. Okay, oh, now I can't even keep up with them now. Oh, my car's gonna blow up. Bloody shit. I can't remember, do you have to get in the first two places to qualify? Or can you come third? I don't know. I can't remember now. Oh, I still can come third though. Alright, so I can still continue. So I can, now I can come in the top three places. Let's go to the garage. Oh, I can't afford it. I can't afford nothing. Shouldn't be delayed because I've turned it on. I've got it on live chat. And I can see what you just said and all. <laughs> Get out of the way, you piece of shit. God. Lost the strength. Shit. Looks fine for where I'm sitting. This is YouTube fucking up. <laughs> so our clans, but mine's only going to go on to half past ten. <laughs> and you've probably got Nova Bug Stream as well. <laughs> Okay. 
Oh, I can't afford. Oh well, Let's see how this one goes. What's that? Should be done by about. What's that? Should be done by about half eight. Alright, so six cars. My engine looks like it's going to blow up. Oh right, packing up the hard drive, okay. You should have two hard drives. Always have two hard drives. One for Windows, oh fucking hell. One for Windows, one where you put your operating system on and the other one where you save your files. Like your music files or whatever files. Oh, she's still okay. Well, this ain't looking good, is it? The engine's gonna blow up. My full cloud. I don't know if it can come full. I'm not sure. Let's we'll find out. I'm in fifth place and this ain't good. No, I'm in sixth place. It's tough at the top. <coughs> Game over. Well, it was good to play that again. I'm quite. I like that game. And so I did prefer the second one, but the first one was still pretty good. Right, it's half past seven, so I'm still playing some more games. Who wants to request the next one? Just check my email. On what? Oh, hang on. Roland on the run. Oh, are you. So I do Roland on the run. That's revenge, innit? I do Roland on the run and I do Peter Packrat afterwards. What's Peter Packrat on? Okay, um, what what system is Peter Packrat on? You want me to review? I can't do arcade. Oh, CP. Oh, they're both on the CPC. Okay, excellent. Okay, we'll do that. Okay. So I've got to do crappy Roland on the run. Well, that'll last about two seconds. <laughs> um, CPC. Right. Roll. Right, rolling in space, rolling in the caves. Rolling on the run. <coughs> yeah. 
Yeah, I know why DVD wants me to play this because I requested it on his stream. Yeah, and I've already reviewed it, so I'm not going to be reviewing it again. What's the keys? That key, that is it. X, X, you jumped from third line. C, oh fucking hell. So that key, that key, Z, X, C. Shit. Right, okay. How many lives? Let's make it. Right. Level one. Right. So that speeds up the train. What we've got to do is get our refugees on up the train. Right, hang on. Let's try this one. It's a really shit game, this. Right. Oh, this is an awful game. It's like Frogger if you think about it. He's flashing. Where they flash, you've got to get them to the to the other side. Right. No. It's really awkward. I should have called this refugee simulator. Oh, this is an awful game. Right, let's try that. No. Right, now he's in the front of the train. Why is he getting in the back of the train? Right. Oh, this is shit. Oh, I've got one score. I've got one point. Ah, uh, I lost. No, I don't particularly want another game of that. That is shit. <laughs> 180 quid, oh yeah, there's that thing I did, that video, yeah, on eBay. Right, let's have a look at Peter Pack Rap. Anything's got to be better than that shit I just played. God, that was crap. Scroll between... Right, what's that mean? Scroll between screens. Uh, is that a good thing? I'll push yes. <coughs> Redefine keys. What? Oh. Left, right. Throw. Right, okay. Right, start a one player game. Oh my god, this is a spectrum pool. Right, how do I go down? Hang on a minute, I've already defined these keys fucking wrong. I think I've really messed up these keys. I'm going to have to restart this. I think I've ruined, fucked up the keys. Yeah, I've messed up the keys. I couldn't go up. All I could do is go down. I think I've, ruined, I've fucked up the keys. Right, scroll between screens. Right, redefine. Let's do QAOP. Q A O P space. That's better. One player. Right, get the flashy things. 
<laughs> God. After playing the arcade game. Well, what am I supposed to do? That's not right. Oh. Bloody hell, I see these are long levels, aren't they? Oh, God. I'm not liking this version as much as the arcade version. Right. Right. Oh, oh right. Okay. Oh, okay. I don't know where I'm going. The arcade one I just took up immediately. This one's a bit... I don't know. But you know damn well it's a spectrum pool. Oh bloody hell. It's just, it's just a lazy spectrum pool. Oh. You can see, you can hear the music slowing down. Oh fucking, what's going on there? All right, okay. Ah. Oh. I oh, wanna oh, this is The screen is so small. It's like I just oh I know, let's pull the spectrum version over because we can't be bothered. I mean, I played the arcade version, that was pretty good. I quite enjoyed that game. This. Oh, that was absolutely shit, that was. Oh, fuck this. How many lives do I get? I mean, if I had it back in the day, I'd probably... And I didn't see the arcade version. I might have thought it was okay, but after playing the arcade version and coming to this. I know you've got to expect limitations when you're playing it on a home computer, but I don't know. <coughs> oh, it was a one not I think one not yeah, one not in the Yeah. One Silverbird 299 titles. Oh, right, okay. Now that bird can fly me. Hey. Oh, I just don't know. Oh, what's that? I'm jumping. Oh. The scrolling sort of messed up though. Oh, 
Ah, oh, some bits and pieces over here. Right, so... Oh, it's nothing, is it? I can't pick them up. Well, we'll go over here, do not I? So, just background graphics. What's this up here? Oh, so I've only got one item. Ah, oh, bollocks. Who lives do you get? We should get unlimited amount of lives in this version or something. Oh, I'll make this one my last life. I can't. I have enough of this. It's time to jump in it. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. No, we're not going to make it. Splash. <laughs> oh god, not RX2, 220 or... Yeah, I suppose, yeah, it's different at least. Oh God! See, I'm sure you get un it's giving you unlimited lives. Yeah, I'm, I don't really like it. No, it's no way as good as the arcade version. Just does my in this is just slow. Colours, it's it's crap because it's a spectrum ball. Music's horrible. Right, who wants to request another game? Ten on. <sighs> pie and oh, pie and chips and waffles. Who's going to be up with this game? <laughs> oh, I've already had my dinner. Gauntlet 2 on the CPC, okay. Now we're talking. Gauntlet 2 on the CPC, it was a good version that. be a problem. So if we're playing as player two or player one, if we're playing as player two, I don't know, we'll work it out. Right, I was always the wizard. When I play, let's play it quick bed, I always was the, the wizard. Right, do we have to have a second player? Oh no, let's pick the Valkyrie. Right, oh yeah, because you can just... Oh, 
Right, let's see if we can jump levels. Not sure I meant that you can do a level skip. Oh, that's it. There's another key. This was an awesome game when you play two player. And the first one. Obviously this one's better than the first one, but the first one was pretty good as well. And the CPC got a good version of both versions of um, Gauntlet. Gauntlet and Gauntlet 2, both were brilliant on the CPC. All those keys. Am I supposed to get to all those keys? Yeah, I first played Gauntlet on the ship. I first played Gauntlet on the Commodore 64 around my mate's house. Spent hours playing that. Right, where am I supposed to go now? Where am I? Oh, bloody up here, innit? Ah, potion, potion. Ah, potion. Ah, bollocks, show it. Where's all my key? How can I get to the keys? Oh, who cares? Exit. Oh, welcome back, classics. Have you had a good dinner? Alright, I don't want to waste keys. I might have to use the key. Oh, bollocks. Ah, ah, exit! Oh, them things, them things, they're horrible, these things. They just fucking instantly kill you. Run away, run away, run away, run away, run away, come on. There's another one there, shit. Ah, he's gonna come out, he's gonna come out, hell. Ah, exit! Exit, come on, run! Yes. Shoot, shots now hurt other players, okay. I didn't like Gauntlet 3, I thought that was a bit crap. Tell you what, Gauntlet 2 was good on the Amiga. Oh shit, I can't do that, can I? Oh, and that's it, I'm dead. <laughs> it's like Doom, it's here. I never played Doom. Never played it. Gauntlet got 73. Yeah, I can see why. I can see why. It is a good game. It is a really good game. I think Gauntlet 2 had a lot more going on. You could do like you can select the colour and um, the character, and I think two two of you could be a wizard or whatever. On the first one, you can only choose a wizard, or the other character could be like the other the other. You couldn't chose colours and so there was a lot more in this version so it was quite good who's going all right Andrew thanks for coming on mate <laughs> right, um, so it's up to you. What do you want to do? Do you want to start the quizzes about eight or would you rather start it about half past eight? 
up to you. I'll leave that one to you. Who's going? All right, we'll do it half eight. Bionic Commando on the Nez. Okay. <laughs> well, Classic's coming there for. We'll see how it goes. We'll see how it goes. Um, we'll play Bionic Commando on the on the Nintendo. I don't know if I've ever played that game. <coughs> oh my god. <coughs> right, um, Bionic. Bionic. Oh, what the fuck? Bionic, can, Bionic Commando, here we go. Okay. Start. That's in. It's... Oh, fucking hell. That's for ratings. Come on. What's this? What's this? Oh right, okay. Why oh, can't I jump? Oh right, so you go up and down. Oh right, so you can't jump, you've got to use that. Right, am I supposed to get up there? Oh, I'm supposed to get up here, isn't it? Oh right, okay, get it. Right, it's firing. Hang on, what can I go? Oh, bloody hell. I thought about that bit then. Oh, here we go. No, I can't go up that bit. Okay. Annoying! Okay, enjoy the match. Uh, you got to start all the way from the beginning again. I'm not enjoying this. Oh god, it can't be any worse than this. Oh, it's, it might look nice, but it's certainly frustrating. It's annoying me. Go up, go up. what I was supposed to be doing there but I've done it yeah, 
any touch should be able to what's that? Okay. Whatever. Well, where am I supposed to go then? Fucking hell. I've had enough of this. Can't be bothered with it. I'm fed up with it. Really? <laughs> yeah, I'm getting fed up with it. Okay. Um, we want to request the next game. Zone on the top. Oh, was that that game he was playing yesterday? Oh, I believe 2600. Battle. Oh. Battle Zone, there we go. Yes! Forward. Oh, what he get me all got him. All right, Hunter's Moon on the what's that? Hunter's Moon Commodore 64. I'll right, we'll do that one next. Fucking give me a chance. Gotcha, surely. Come on. Oh, come on. All oh, right, send another go. Send one more go. Gonna play out this moon. So look at the radio up the top. Oh, there's two up there. All right. I didn't get it. Right. Oh, so when that line turns yellow, it means you've got him on target, I guess. Get me surely. Bollocks. I have to say, it's, this looks rather impressive on the twenty six hundred. Ah, oh, he got me. That's it. Game over. That's quite good. That is quite good. All right. Okay. All right. Let's get the Commodore 64 out. 
Hunter's Moon, never heard of that game. Hunter's Moon, here we are. <laughs> yeah, of course it would. Hitler's. Yeah. Right. Unlimited lives? No. Unlimited cheats? No. Let's return. What's oh, a famous game? Yeah, it's one I've never played. Oh, weird controls are weird. Fuck. So you gotta push in the direction you wanna go. Alright, okay. Fuck! You just shoot, just shoot. Fuck it. Hell. Controls are weird. Am I supposed to escape this? <gasps> Gee. Right, go. go yes, we've escaped. That bloody time, now what do we do? Oh, I've got a map here. Come on, it's right. Do we just keep shooting them? Well, they keep respawning, so I don't understand that. I can't be sure. What should we do over here then? Alright, oh, something. Ah, maybe we've got to get in the centre things. Oh shit! Come on! Radar, yes, yeah, so you got to collect the middle. I think it's the middle bits you got to collect. Why is the why? Am I that white dot? So, why does the white dot go in a different direction to where I'm going? All right, so there's nothing there. This is weird. Go! Go! Fuck it now! I didn't enjoy that. Don't like the controls on that. That is a weird game. Tap on the time is 2600. Well, I've got it. Oh, sorry, I've got it. Oh, it should be interesting. Oh, shit. No, I didn't want to do that. Damn. It's actually a good version, actually.
Oh shit! Come on, alright. Yes. That's a good version. I'm gonna have another guy this because it's that good of a version to be honest with you. Smurfs on the 2600. Alright, we'll have a look at Smurfs. Good game this one. Very good. A very, very good conversion on the 2600. That's good. Alright, Smurfs. Oh, here we go. Rescue in Gargamel's Castle. We've got two. Hang on a minute. We've got Smurfs Save the Day. We've got Smurfs Arcade Action or Smurfs Rescue in Gargamel's Castle. I think... I think the... I don't know. So what one do you want me to do? I've got three. Oh, you can actually see what I've got. Okay. <laughs> oh, my old castle. Right, we'll have a look at that. Oh, my God. Right, why are we moving? Oh, here we go. Oh, my God. Oh my, oh, so you walk into a fence and you die. 
Oh god oh my, this is difficult. This is fucking difficult to jump. Oh, oh shit. This is difficult. Really difficult to jump. This is ridiculous. I jumped then, it didn't respond. What? I see a fucking electric fence. This is stupid. No, you don't walk through it, you die. Must be a different... I don't get that. No, you've got to walk that way. You're taking the piss! That is fucking ridiculous! I hate to imagine what the rest of the game's going to be like if I can't get past this fucking fence. That is bollocks. <laughs> I mean, this is just stupid. Right, how far? Oh wait, how did I do that? Hang on a minute, how did I jump as high as I did? I don't know. Oh no, now I've got to get through that fucking... How did I do that? Alright, oh, do I double tap up? Right, so you double tap up. Oh, now we're in trouble. Oh, bollocks. I feel... Bullshit. Right, let's just have one more go at that. Just to make sure. Right, it's double tap. You've got to double tap it up. Turning me, it's an annoying game. Oh, shit. Oh my god, so you got all this just to rest your fucking smurf fucking it. having a fucking laugh. All that and you've got to do the thing again. Oh no, you can make it so and now we've got this bloody thing. Now you can't beat it up. And, oh, the fence. Hang on. Oh my god, now it gets predicted. Oh, I've had enough of that bullshit. Seriously. 
That's just crap. That was absolutely crap. Oh, you can duck, can you? Oh, right, okay. Yeah, that's shit. <laughs> I won't be playing that again. Right, I think we've got time for one more game, then we'll go on to the quiz, and I can have a drink. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Stad and mice. Oh, I can't remember. One's Angs. Oh, I, can't, I can't fucking remember now. What a load of bollocks, more like. I thought um, Smurfette was at part of their. I thought it was just their sisters or something. So a little bit of insects going on there. Mega Drive, okay. Well, this will be the final game until we go, until we go on the... Uh, blah, what's going on? Right, escape. Right, Mega Drive. Mega Drive, Mega Drive, Mega Drive. No, wrong one. Spider-Man and... Spider-Man and Venom. Spider-Man and Venom. Maximum carnage. Okay, here we are. Well, we won't have time to do North and South now. Um, we'll probably do that on the next stream because we're going to go on to the quizzes after this. And that'll take forever to play. <laughs> a bit of a strategy game, that one. Yeah, that's right, it was, wasn't it? Um, Foul Channel, it was. Garg created by Gargamel. Yeah, I had that on the Amiga North and South. But remember, it takes a long time to play. So maybe we'll play that on the next stream. Have I played this before? I'll maybe play that in the next time, um, Foul Channel. Keep those games in mind, we'll play them next time. So I'll have a drink, drink now, and I'll have a relax and chill out. I mean, this one don't play too badly. Just wanted to go and see. Oh, thank you, Classics. Very nice of you to do that. <laughs> I'll play some good ones today, don't get me wrong. I'll play some pretty good games today. Some that I might consider reviewing. 
Oh, where are we going? Extra life. I oh, remember, remember, if you come, if I do another, I don't know when, I'll, probably next week, maybe. Um, remember them games, and we'll play them next week. Yeah, I think the graphics are quite nice. Plays pretty good. Plays pretty well, actually. Might have to consider reviewing this. <coughs> yeah, but you might be able to upload other games onto it. You never know. Like with the uh, PlayStation Classic can you can hack it. ROMs are free to get, so I don't see why not. Oh right, okay, let's try. Oh, we can throw them. Okay, and I've been knocked out. Right, how many lives? One life left. How the hell? Right, let's try some other part. Ah. ah, Sonic's alright, but I'm not a big fan of platform games, to be honest with you, anyway. Game over. <coughs> I won't continue, but yeah, it's a pretty impressive game, that. I quite like it. Right, okay, that's the gaming side done. Let's do some quizzes. Let's, let's start off with Baby Boomer, everyone's favourite trivial pursuit. It's the other one. I think it's the one <laughs> we can answer the most questions with this one. So it's favourite with everyone, right. I'm not a fan of them, to be honest with you, Foul Channel. I'm not. I won't buy one. Well, I've got emulation and it's free. And I can get all the ROMs I want. That's why I won't buy a mini console. Don't need one. I mean, I can understand if you want to use it on your telly. Um, I can understand that. Plus, plug it for your HDMI. But to record with, everything's here. I can record. Yeah, now that would be worth it. Um, a, a main emulator that, you know, is a little console. Now that would be worth checking out. Someone actually building one, like a Raspberry Pi size thing. Right. Um, yeah, that should be your pursuit. I'll, I'll get this loading and I'll go and get some beers. Um, <coughs> this one. Now I'll put this two in as well. And we round it off with um trivia quiz like we usually do. Alright. Trivia suit. Alright, this two. Right. Yep, we're about to do the quiz. We're going to play Trivial Pursuit and I'll be back in a couple of minutes.
Right. <laughs> okay. Right. Well, what's going on? Hello, Era 42, how are you doing? Right, okay. Load questions. Right. I need to swap the discs over. Right, pick a question block, someone. J. Okay, let's start the game. Right, here we go. Right, choose a subject. I think I know where you're going for. <laughs> <coughs> Silver screen, okay. Well, I think we had a bit of lag with the chat just there. Everything just seemed to come up at once. All right. Right, silver screen it is. Now, what am I doing? Which actress is from this country was voted most popular film star in 1969? What the fuck is that? That's Italy, isn't it? Is it Italy? Retina Garbo, John Wayne. What's that? Yes. Rush. Oh, I missed the conversation there, Andreas. What was that? Cheers, John. Right. John Wayne, Quentin Garbo. Right. Gina. Oh, sorry, I'm. Um, I don't know, I think there's something up with the chat. It's just, it stops and it just sort of comes up at once. Right, what are we saying? We're saying Gina Lombardo. <whistles> Sophia Lauren. Did anyone say that? No. Right, got that one? Very dumb. <laughs> Didn't matter, went for a wedge. Alright, okay. Six. So I'm take let's take it silver screen because it's close to the we're close to the outer board then. Let's just go for silver screen on that one. <coughs> <coughs> what was the film musical in nineteen sixty five? What? What was the film musical of sixty five? We got a lag going on because
Sound of Music. The Sound of Music, yeah. Right, okay. Chitty Chitty Bang Bang. Oliver. The Sound of Music. Well done, DVD. for grey. Two! That's a wedge! And then times. Life and times I'm guessing. What American coastal city once proclaimed itself the new Liverpool? Good to see you back. <coughs> the new Liverpool. Any town USA, Miami. <laughs> itself, new Liverpool. Um, let's take a guess on this one. Coastal City. California? No. It's got to be somewhere in New England. I ain't got a clue. San Francisco. I was near enough, right? I said California. <laughs> Uh, Alright then, RPM or publishing? C. We'll see. Okay, classic RPM. The singer Benny King. <laughs> right, the singer Benny King was a member of which soul group of the 50s <coughs> well, it's a music question so I don't know I ain't got a clue don't know nothing really much about the 50s it's something to do with music the temptations I don't know what it stands for, but the M must stand for music. The Drifters. Well, we've got the Temptations, we've got the Drifters. Drifters. Hey Stefano, how are you doing? And it's absolutely correct. Well done, Clansman. Well done, Stefano. <coughs> Excuse me.
Oh, that's a grey. Five. Oh, wedge. What son of Robert Morley is a drama critic and broadcaster? Oh, I ain't got a clue. Oh, you got an headache. Oh dear, I hope you put some, got some headache pills, tablets. <laughs> yeah, I hated school. Well, I hated high school. Winton. Is it? <laughs> Wilton. Wilton Morley? Alright, we'll go with Wilton Morley. No. Sheridan. I would have known that. Right, so. Do you reckon RPM again? <coughs> it's alright, don't apologise. No need to. about having fun. Unlike those miserable gits in the bloody MSS, MSX group. <coughs> who had its who had his first hit record with in the midnight hour. In the midnight hour. Is that um, Billy Idol? In the midnight hour to grab more, more, more. Miserable gits in the MSX group on Facebook. Wilson Pickett, right, missed the answer there, what was the answer, what, alright, Wilson Pickett it is, right, we'll go with that, and well, <coughs> well done Stefano, well done Klansman. we'll beat him up, Oh right, um okay. Four or oh, ah ah and go for an RPF silver screen wedge. <coughs> Uko Uko starred with Woody Allen in the Broadway version of Play It Again Sam. Remember it's for a wedge. Fade on away. Alright, anyone gonna have a guess or they know the answer? <coughs> God. Well shall I just go with fade on away?
streaming spot. Oh, I don't know. Can't do nothing about it. Oh, you're, I know what you're talking about. You're talking about Double Dragon 2. Yeah, I remember Stefano. Yeah, Ste Double Dragon 2 that was. Is anyone going to have a guess at this question or should I just go for it? <coughs> Diana Keaton, no. Do you want to go for R RPM, I'm guessing, or shitty colour? Bloody hell, this, this chat seems to be really lagging. DVD got in there quickly. Who reached number eight with the twelfth or never in Kajagoogoo? No, it wouldn't be Kajagoogoo. Alright, Neil, how are you doing? That was an 80s band, I'm sure. Cliff Richard? Stefano saying? Alright, let's see. Cliff Richard, we'll go, oh, baby. Stefano's right. Oh, right. <laughs> Free. Oh, we can go for a shitty kind of wedge. How you doing anyway, Neil? What London market did Michael Caine once work in? London Market, the Stock Exchange? I work for the Stock Exchange. Shut your fucking face up. Well, Michael Caine? Oh, well, you oh, Cliff Richard. No, I can't really stand Cliff Richard. He's fucking chat is so laggy tonight Michael Caine's good. Yeah, I, I'm not a big, I'm not a fan of Cliff Richard. 
Okay, good. Orange juice. Orange <laughs> juice in trading places. <laughs> Brilliant film. Brilliant film trading places. Right, or should we let's just go for it then? What? Billingsgate? <laughs> Way off. Oh, grey. One. So, <coughs> RPM or broadcasting? <laughs> Educating Rita, I've not seen that one. I've not seen that film. DBT says broadcasting. Which, which section of the army camp was Bill Coe in charge? Is it the motor section or the maintenance section? Oh no, I don't didn't watch Bill, Sergeant Bill Cobble, was it the maintenance section or something like that? I don't know, perhaps someone might know. Maltese TV monitor pool. Well, I'll go with Maltese TV monitor pool. Seems to... the motor pool. I think that's what you meant, were not it? The motor. I was sort. Of, I was sort of all right. I mean, maintenance sort of thing. So yeah, you, you, yeah, we'll give you that one. <laughs> Five. I am taking it um, publishing or silver screen. That's cheating. We can't Google. Can't do Google. Hope you. I hope you knew that one. I hope you knew that. Which musical does I Whistle a Happy Tune come from? Our <laughs> oh, movies have gone right downhill now. It's like music. 
I don't know, it's just lost a lot of its charm, it's just crap. Singing in the rain. King and I. Right, let's have a look. The King and I are well done, clansmen. Right, a wedge news. What clothing concession was made to Boy Scouts in 19, November 1960? I ain't got a fucking clue. Benetton? <laughs> <laughs> Are they still around, Benetton? Shorts, cravats, army and navy. <laughs> right, let's have a look. Long trousers. Well, well, uh, <laughs> one, ah, oh, damn it. What's up here? What thing? What what theme song was Jane Fonda film? Jane Fonda film was it a hit for racing? Hang on. What theme song from a Jane Fonda film was a hit for racing cars in 1977? I don't know. I've never seen the film. Don't know. I ain't got a clue. I'll go with classics. They shot horses, didn't that? Don't they? No idea. No idea. Two. Right, two of our favourite subjects. Silver screen or RPM. We haven't even got a wedge yet. <laughs> Silver screen. Who played the part of Chris in The Magnificent Seven? 
never seen it. RPM. RPM's music. But I don't know what it stands for. Obviously the M stands for music. Oh, your Brenner. Your Brenner, real Brenner, your Brenner. Yep, you're absolutely right. Classics, DVD, Stefano. Alright, grey. Oh, wedge. Seven times. Yeah, it's revolutions per minute if you're in a car. It is. Who fathered Arlo Gunthrey? Who fathered Arlo Gunthrey? Oh, okay. Yep. Yep, yeah, could be right there. And 33. A male prostitute. Take it, no one knows. <laughs> Never, yeah. Woody Gumfrey. All right, hang on. Woody Gumfrey. Well done, Stefano. And that's off our first wedge we got. So brilliant. Right, so I suppose we can go around anyway. One RPM or broadcasting. I've never owned, I've never ever owned any records. RPM Who was singing Come Outside in This has got to be the. I don't know. I don't know. If some people experience lag worse than others. I think a lot more went into vinyl, though. I, I really think they put a lot more effort into the covering, the artwork, into vinyl because obviously it was bigger and. I don't know. Mike Shane Wendy Richard. Right. Well Mike oh I'll give you that. I'll, yeah, I'll definitely give you that, Stefano.
pulled on again. Five. One. Or red or blue broadcasting or publishing. I think some people experience lag worse than others. I don't know. Perhaps I think it's YouTube. I mean, I've had this shitty internet for a long, long time, and I think it's YouTube. Right, publishing. Nice. Right, okay. Who could people who could Peter Parker turn into after being bitten by a radioactive star? It's fucking Spider Man. I'm sure we all know this. Yes. It was that obvious that I, I even knew it. Right, we can go for a, a wedge news. Which fugitive's car was found at New Haven in no, November 1974? Alright, Klansman. Which fugitive's car was found at New Haven? Well, my speed's pretty slow, so. But my speed's been. I've had the same internet since I've been streaming, so I don't know. All that all I've replaced was the modem. Lord Lucan. Lord Lucan, and it's absolutely right. Well done, Stefano. You're on fire tonight, mate. And that's another wedged. So we got we got that one, we got that one. Let's go around the ball to this way. Let's go this way. So shitty colour. What coin was dropped from British currency in nineteen fifty six? What coin was dropped in fifty six? I wouldn't have a clue. Because Daryl was going by the old money back then, before it went, before it went decimal. Half a crown. No, it weren't a penny. We still got the penny. Weren't the half p? That was in the eighties. Now you got to think of old money, because it, we didn't, it didn't go decimal to 73, so you got to think of like half a crown, shilling, no that was 5p weren't it, hang on the shilling was 5p, I don't know, it could be, I, I say it could be the shilling, penny, well we still got the penny, um, I don't know, you say the shilling, I'll say the half a crown, I don't know, the farthing, <laughs> Damn it. 
Uh, well, let's go around this way. So let's go for orange. The search for which female kidnap victim was headed by FBI agent Charles Bates, also known as Master Bates. <laughs> So we don't know this one. I don't think it's a bit quiet. Or it's a major lag. I think it's a bit quiet, so I don't think no one knows. Patty Hurst. No, nope, I don't think anyone knew that. What song chorus began there's goes my reason for living RPM remember and it's a wedge Is that, a, is that, you saying Elvis, is that another um, line from that song, Stefano? There he goes, my everything. Whoa, whoa, Klansman's saying, saying the same thing. So it could be Elvis. I misunderstood that. But Stefano was right and so was Klansman. And that's another wedge. Stefano, that's three wedges you've got so far. Well done. You're doing well. Alright, let's go this way. In which decade were these introduced? The MOT. Which decade the... 50s I would say the 50s classic seems to agree I 
I think it was the thirties. I could be wrong when you had to get a driving license. Hmm. I would say everyone's all Klansman saying sixties, so is Stefano. Right, so it's the fifties or the sixties. Well it doesn't matter because it's not for a wedge. So it's over the sixties, the fifties or the sixties. And you're absolutely right, Klansman, and so is you Stefano. And okay, I didn't know that. Right, should we show? Right, I think we've got more of a. We'll go for orange because I think we've got more of a chance. When did Britain join the EEC? That was 72, wasn't it? Ye I thought it was 73. No, it, was 70, it might be 72 then. The European. Now this is the thing we're trying to get out of now. Yeah, 72, I'll tend to say 72. The EEC. Does anyone know what it stands for? The European Summit Council? Yep. So we joined in 72 and we may leave in 2025 or something like that. <laughs> but who remembers what the EEC stood for? European Economic, Economic Community, yes. But I don't think it's the EEC anymore. Do you know she's quitting? She's quitting this month. Go for orange again. It probably won't happen. I can't see it happening. I mean, it's, it's taking too long. We've voted out in 2016, it's 2019, and fuck all's happened. What country forces were the first to? Enter Egyptian territory in the Suezi War. Suezi War. Uh, Suezi War. Uh, I can't believe say that. I ain't got a clue. American? Stefano says Israel. Well, the way you've been going tonight, mate, I would not doubt you. Israel, the Egyptians. <laughs> Let's go. With. And it and Stefano's right. Well done. Let's put my light on now. Walk like an Egyptian. Right, okay. One. Silver screen. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, what 61 horror film was set in a Spanish castle torture chamber?
No, I just reckon Stefano's quite intelligent. <laughs> The haunting. Oh, uh, the pit and the right. Well, two. Well, and Stefano's on fire. <coughs> well done again. for the grey to all blue wedge RPM wedge who wrote and had an hit with Mandy it's a it's a blue wedge it's an RPM wedge with Mandy. Barry Manlow. What film was that? I, I remember making a video about that. I've got to watch that one again because I remember doing something like that. A pit in the landing. I don't know that one. Sue's right. Barry Manilow. Barry Manilow. Pin Penland. Right. Yeah, Stefano got that one correct. And that's four wedges now for Stefano. Right, so we'll need. Ah. Ah, wait a minute. So we've got to get the red one and. Uh, and the one down the bottom. So what do you want to go for? Do you want to try and go for the red one with silver screen or do you want to go and go for silver screen with the red one? Hang on, that don't make sense. <laughs> do you want to go for the red one by going for the purple one or do you want to go for the purple one by going for the red one? <laughs> Did you get a glanceman? Sorry about that. Yeah, absolutely correct. I stand corrected on that one. <coughs> Sorry. <laughs> sorry, clansman. That one's your wedge. I am absolutely sorry about that one. I didn't see that. Yes. That was absolutely my mistake. That one was your wedge, Clansman. My eyes was playing tricks on me there. So you got one wedge there, Clansman. Brilliant. You're a Barry Manlow fan, oh. Red, okay. We go for red. What was McLeod's first name? Cloudy McLeod? Sunny McLeod? Connor, Connor McLeod. Nice red one. Sam McLeod. Right, so Sam, I think Sam, I think we've got Klansman and Stefano saying Sam. So, and it's correct. 
Well done, Sam. No. Well done, Clansman. Well done, Stefano. Five, right. Five. Well, we need to go for red. Which, what 50s children's TV series featured a boy called Corky? Don't know. I don't know. I honestly can't. I don't understand what's going on, plans, but I don't know. Torchy the battery boy. Okay. Right, okay. Circus boy. Oh, Steph. Oh. Sir, Steph. When I. Yeah, I'll give that one to Stefano because that is absolutely correct. Because I. I pushed it before Stefano answered the answer, but that answer immediately came up. Well, it didn't. It came up about a second after. So yes, I'll give you that one. Right. Okay. Right. Let's go for grey. One. Let's go for orange. Which. What which feature which sorry what which future president was there Oh fuck it which which future president was three cars back when John F. Kennedy was shot? George Bush? Not George, not the uh, second George, Ronald Reagan? Ronald, could be, actually, could be. Actually, could be, actually. Ronald Reagan, that's two for Ronald Reagan, I reckon. I think that could be correct, actually. Let's have a look. No, Live and B. Johnson. Didn't even know President Johnson. Don't know. One. Oh, no. Come on, we've already got that wedge. To go for red. From what downtown area did Rowan and Martin's laughing come to you? New York? Only thing I can think of, maybe New York, I don't know. Well, it's got to be America because downtown they say America as we say town centre.
what else can I say? Manhattan. New York, Manhattan. Let's go for it. Burbank. Burbank is in California. Oh, wedge. Silver screen. What did Charles Grodin and Cadiz Virgin steal from 11 Harrow House? Diamond A diamond, yeah, possibly the TV <laughs> A diamond. So that's two for diamond. Shall we say diamond? It's two for diamond. And DVD and classics were absolutely right. <laughs> so, that's another wedge. So, one more wedge, 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 wedge to go for. And that is the red one. So, let's go for grey. Let's go for grey. Let's go for grey. And let's go for grey. And let's go for the wedge. Who introduced TV's The World of Beach Coom? Coomba? Coom? In 72. Who introduced TV's The World of Beach Coom in 72. Ralph Harris. <laughs> Good, it was before I was born. <laughs> oh, Doma, Doma, got some peas. Oh dear. Oh dear, Noma. My mate years ago he could do an awesome impression of John Major. The world of Spike Milligan? Yeah, I don't know. I ain't got no clue. Introduced to the world of. Let's go for it. I don't think no one knows. Fucking else! Classics! Classics got it right! Well done, mate! That's all the wedges now. Now we just need to get to the middle. Well, right, let's go for RPM. What group had a hit in 1970 singing? In the summertime when I know this. That was, oh shit. Mungo Jerry. Uh, 
there's no silver screen there but we got RPM so I'll let you ch I'll let you choose yep there's Mungo Ger Mungo Jerry so I'll go for RPM if you disagree anyway if you disagree to go for another car we go for the other car squares are the grey squares you basically you land on it you get another go you don't have to answer any questions a free go right clansmen we'll go for RPM What sort? What sort of match? So what sort of a match is being looked for? What? What sort of a match is being looked for? boxer matches um, a match what a football match a boxing match a wrestling match a tennis match <laughs> cricket match I don't know blame YouTube I don't know what's going on football yeah twats football absolutely correct well it ain't even football I would talk, I'll call it twats rugby if anything it's not football how often do they use their feet for fucking no the majority of it's in their fucking hands how can they call it football Blame Thatcher, no, can't blame Thatcher for that. Right, what sort of match? A golf match? Um, I don't know, uh, a lighted match? No one knows. A matchmaker? <laughs> Fucking hell. Name your subject. The only one we can't go for. Oh, yes, we can. So, what do you want to go for? Oh, so you see, a lot of people are having problems. I don't know what's going on. I can't tell you what's going on. Silver screen. Okay, DVD. Excuse me. Who in 75 became the oldest actor to win an Oscar? Right, I think 75. And who was an old actor then? I would have been one years old, so. <laughs> Robert Redford?
pony. Let's go for it, it's not four. Jules Burns, no. Ah, oh, fuck! I don't, it's. Classics and. Ah, oh, bloody lag. You got that right, I know. You both got that right. It doesn't. It doesn't really matter. It weren't for a wedge or anything important. So, but yeah, I do apologise for that. Right. What I'll do? Let's try and end this game quick. I'll just go for RPM or or silver screen. Who followed his first number one hit with Claire? With get down and. Oh baby. What's your oh, I dunno, what the fuck am I thinking then? What the, What was the answer? I can't remember. <laughs> I can't fucking remember the answer. Bloody hell, what's going on with me? Shit. Anyway, do you know this answer? Gilbert O'Sullivan. Who followed the number one clear? Gilbert O'Sullivan? Cla um, class Cla Clansman seems to be. And well done, well done, Clansman. Right, RPM, we got our favourite there, RPM or silver screen. This lag is terrible tonight. DVDs don't seem to have that bad of a lag. Who played the servant in The Servant? Absolutely correct there, classics. Well done. Ah, fucking hell. Right, would you reckon silver screen or whatever? Silver screen RPM. What, what subjects do you prefer? What is the preference subject? Silver screen or RPM? Because that would... Right, we'll go for silver screen. What did Senna... What? Senna? Why? Senna Ferrari wear on his head in Casablanca. I've never seen Casablanca. A fez. A 
stupid hat. <laughs> I don't know this. And well done, classics. Oh, we can win the game. Right, important choice. What is the subject going to be? This is for the game. Silver screen, okay. We'll go for silver screen for the game. Which make of motorcycle did Marlon Brando ride in the wild one? Harley Davidson, surely, isn't it? It's got to be a Harley Davidson. Fucking hell, 30 second lag. Jeez, it's usually about a five second lag. 30 seconds, that's fucking eternity. A Triumph Thunderbird, fuck it. You sound confident on that one. It's an American film. Well, I, I tend to, I, I, I will agree with Stefano because he knows his stuff. So, and you're absolutely correct there, Stefano. We've won the game. Well done. We won the game! Yes! Right, so... Publishing was our weakest subject. Silver screen, obviously, and RPM. Yeah. Okay, we did well there. Okay, you know what we're going to do now then, don't you? Let's load our snapshot and continue with this game. Here we go. I'm just going for a quick piss. And we'll continue.
Okay. What do you want to go for? Show business, trivia, sports, show business or trivia? Okay, classics is trivia. Okay, Stefano. Oh, enter. What is the main diet of a badger? Vegetarian, worms, or slugs? B, right, classics is B, and um, Stefano, not Stefano, DVD, says C. So B is the majority at the moment with um, error. So shall we say B? That seems to be the majority at the moment. Absolutely correct, well done. And well done, yes, well done. All right. Musical show business. Show business DVD says, okay. What kind of show does Melvin Bragg present? A quiz show, an art show, a current affairs show. I've heard of Melvin Bragg. Is it a quiz show? <laughs> C a current affair show this lag is terrible bloody hell arts so we've got um, two three two for C two for B Art show, South Bank show. Will the South Bank show be current affairs though? So we're saying either B or C. Seem confident with B, okay. We'll go with B. You saying Right, B is an art show. And that's absolutely correct. Well done. Right, we have to go with trivia. What does the prefix mega represent? 100, 1000, 1 million.
be, which is 1000. I ain't got a clue. 1 million zillion. <laughs> million zillions, million squillion zillion. <laughs> Mega is a million. Right, so we go with C. So, error. 42 seems to say it's a million I mega maybe I I tend to agree with that we'll say C we'll say C and it's absolutely correct well done right we can only go for music Which instrument did Faith is It's guitar Did the 50s artist Les Paul play? It was the guitar. Star question. What is Les, well, I can't bloody pronounce that. Les Aspo. A cat, a horse, or a dog? God, this, I think this lag's getting worse. Yeah, this is a terrible lag. It's getting worse now. Right. For this question, can you please say... Oh, okay, Klansman, 100% a dog. Okay. Alright, never mind what I was about to say. Let's see if I can do this quickly. Well done, Clansman. So, would you want to go for sports music? Music? Oh, Joker. Show business? Oh, I have to go to show business. How many times did Lena Sam was a variety when opportunity knocks? One, three, or five? Who the fuck is that? <laughs> I ain't got a clue. Oh, DVD says free, so does classic, but maybe. Wedges, that's one hell of a lag. <laughs> we finished that ages ago. <laughs> So, hang on, three. So, it looks like 
Well, confident, it's, it's just a guess, isn't it? Free, free, I ain't got no clue. I don't think anyone's answered so we go with free, we go with B. No one else seems to know, so we go with B. And it's wrong! So right, we only lost we only lost 10p. Right, okay. Joker. Music. Which of the following is not of oh hang on. We've had this before. Which of the following is not a five star album? Sink, Silk and Steel, Tango in the Night, or Luxury or Life? I do not know. Definitely not A. I don't know this. I would not know this answer. I didn't like. I, I wasn't into five star at all, so I didn't really care. So <laughs> I didn't really care about five star. Oh, so they actually won something then. So they didn't win the Premiership. When I thought... Right, Tango in the Night. Right, Klansman saying... Right, we... Right, we go with Tango in the Night. Okay. And you were absolutely right there, Clansman. Well done. Right, well, we have to go with trivia. What is the psi unit of power? Watt, volt, or joule? What is the psi unit of power? It's what? No, it could be volt. I don't know. I don't know. It's kilojoules, volts, they all got something to do with power. I don't know. What volt or joules? Oh, hello, Wolf. Wolf Soft Games, how you doing? It's A. Okay, Stefano. I am well done, Stefano. I am well done, Clansman. And well done, Matt. Right, we've got to go. With... Oh, no, we've got to go with music. Shit. Hang on. Who recorded the album True Blue, The Pet Shop Boys, Madonna or 10CC? The album a five star. 80s band. 80s crap or something. I don't know. Madonna?
Right, so we're saying Madonna. Okay, everyone, we'll go with Madonna. Absolutely correct. Well done. What Elizabeth Blackwell's claim to fame. First woman in space, first female doctor, first female MP. Hello Nicholas, how are you doing? Yep, you're very late. I will be ending the stream about half ten. Very crafty person, you. <laughs> Alright, the next stream, yep. The next stream. That may be next week. Right, so a doctor. Stefano says B. And so does Klansman, so it could be a female doctor. Ooh, now Maltese is saying C. And the majority is saying B at the moment. <laughs> so I think B could the majority is with B so we go with B and it's correct well done Stefano well done Klansman Right, show business style oh, joker. Music or trivia? My lag is terrible tonight. Let's turn that off, it's getting cold now. Guarantee it's going to get hot now, and I'll turn that off. Yep, we can feel the heat. Music. All right, we go with music. Oh, shit, I've bloody paused it. What are we doing? What the fuck am I doing? Turn that back on, it's getting hot. Who recorded a big country? ABC Big Country or level 42? Big Country. In a big country, but is it? I ain't got a clue. I don't know. So everyone, all right, everyone's saying B. Okay, that's what we're going for. B. Yep. Well done, everyone. Yeah, it was obviously obvious, obvious. But then it could have been a trick question. Who recorded the album? Misplaced Childhood, Aretha Franklin, Europe, or Meridian. Right. B. 
B, is it Europe? I don't know. Ow. This lag is getting on my nerves. Right. Oh. So, Matt says A. Now we're saying C. Two for C. Three for C. Right, it's mar Marillion. Okay. That's three for C. Oh, no, 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 no. I didn't push the... That was my stupid fault. That was my fault. That was my fucking fault. I pushed the wrong button. Sorry. Shit. I pushed. I didn't realise. Yeah, that's fire button, isn't it? Of course it is. I pushed that by mistake. I absolutely sorry about that. That was my stupid fault. All right. Sorry. I tend to agree, but that was my silly fault at the end of the day. Um, we've got to go for a sports question. Totally apologise for that. How many members in a baseball team? Seven, five or nine? Yep, two jokers in a row. Seven. So that's right. I can use that. Bear that in mind. Okay. That'd be quicker, actually. So I guess well, we've got one for seven, one for five. Psycho. Right. Ooh. Right. <laughs> right. We got one for. DVD says seven. Matt says five, Stefano says nine. My right, right, okay. I will totally agree with Stefano and Klansman on that one. Ugh. Correct, well done. Right, trip, it has to be trivia. What's a cool bar? Cool a bar? A tree, a bear, or an insect? Ah! I hated baseball. I really fucking hated baseball. I fucking hated American football. I hated American. I like American motor racing, of course. Yeah, <laughs> B and it's spelt. So the programmers have made a mistake. Alright. I made a mistake. Cool. That's right. Hey. Yeah, the programmers have made a mistake. H instead of an R. So it's a tree. Okay. Okay, we go with tree. And well done, you're all barking up the right tree. Right, star question. No, it's all right. We got the we got the answer right. Well, you got the answer right, more like. You all got the right answer right, more like. Not me. Right. What kind of creature is a? Sm oh, we had this. We had this. So many times, and I still don't know the fucking answer. Which, what kind of creature is a smew? A worm, a duck, or a mouse? It's a duck, isn't it?
and it's correct, well done. Yeah, as I keep saying, it's not a lot I can do about it. Nothing I can do about the lag. Right, okay. All right, we have to go over trivia, show business, show business, music or music. Bloody hell, the lag is terrible. Right, show business. Okay, let's go for the middle show business. In which vintage comedy series would you find... Ah, oh, for fuck's sake, that's rising damp. go for music. I wait, I wait till the I wait till the lag catches up. Because we probably all knew the answer. Yeah here we go now the now it's catching up. Alright we'll go for music. Who recorded the album Afterburner? Leonard Cohen a ZZ Top or Barbara Dixon. <laughs> right, it's easy top. Right, it's easy top then. And well done everyone. Right, oh Joker. Right, that's to be trivia. What is the most popular last name in the world? Smith, Jones or Chang? <laughs> That's difficult. That's very difficult. I'll tend to go for Chang because um, China is a massive country. Right, Matt says A. Hey. So does DVD. <coughs> so that's free for Smith. Okay, we'll go for Smith. And it's not right. I reckon it was Chang. Ooh, we're only down to 20p now. Joker, or well, go for Joker, obviously. Music, that's all we can go for. Which of the following is not a Genesis album? Come on, you're gonna know this. Coming around again, Invisible Touch, or a, a backer. What? A back? A bad cab? But I can't say that. Now, there's a lot of, lot of you out there that know your Genesis. And... Stefano says A. Bloody hell. That lag is terrible. A. Right, it's Cardi Simon. Coming around again, we'll say A. Absolutely correct, well done. Right, that has to be trivia. 
Where is the capital of Scotland? Aberdeen. It's, it's Edinburgh. But I want to I wanna double check that. I'm sure it's Edinburgh. It's terrible lag. Bloody absolutely terrible lag tonight. Yeah, everyone's agreeing. It's it's Edinburgh. We all know that. Sports. So we can go for. At what event did? What event did? Right, well, there was no space there. What? At what? event did Space Wilkie win his gold medal in Montreal 200 metre brush strokes 400 metre brush strokes or 100 metre freestyle I ain't got a clue Oh, okay. Oh, fuck off. What's going on? Right. B, 400 metres. Okay, right, I'll, I'll go with Maltese TV on that one. Fuck. And it's wrong! Ooh, down to 10p, down to 10p. Right, this will be the last. This will be the last one. I'll call it a night. Another joker. Another joker. <laughs> right, show business. Sorry, I'm getting a little bit. I don't know what's going on. Sorry. I don't know what's going on. What is the subject of the film? A watership down. The Watergate crisis, the rabbit lifestyle. Rabbit lifestyle. Yes, we all know that one. Right, the top question. This will be the last question of the night. From which, from what planet is linen made? Wheat, flax, or cotton? How come we out of three hundred and fifty points? I have never seen Bright Eyes. It was a 78 film, yeah, I remember it, but I've never seen it. And I think I've actually got it. Right, Flax. So. Right. Oh, now, hang on. So we got. Um, B for flax, C for cotton, 
All right, what is it going to be? Because now we got. Flax, we go with Stefano, we go with B. Absolutely correct, well done. Well done. We've only got. Right, we've got Tempe in the kitty, but I will save the state. Or the snapshot. Yes, we'll save it. So So I hope you all enjoyed the stream tonight. I am with Zoglands. Zoglands Yeah, I still. <laughs> All right, guys. Yep, half ten. Um, hope you enjoyed the stream. Um, it's been great, and I may do a stream next week. We'll see how it goes. Um, hopefully, see you all soon. You all take care. Thank you so much for coming on. It's been great. Um, I don't know what's going on with the lag. I I can't I can I can't explain that. I'm sorry, but probably down to YouTube, maybe down to my internet. I don't know. Anyway, thank you all for coming on. Um, I'll see you next time. Goodbye.